while they're called out, Anthony Joshua, just curious on who yeah, you I think that... see that fight, but I don't think AJ's got the minerals to take that fight. Ooh. And, and that's it, I just don't. I just don't think he'll fight anyone who'll knock him out. Mm. And that's it. Okay. I just well, don't, that's my personal opinion. Yeah. And Wilder will definitely knock out Joshua. I'll have a million quid on it with anybody. Oh. A million, even money. Not a problem. Wilder knocks him out cold. Final... Those are the words... Of Tyson, the Gypsy King Fury, and he bets a million quid that Wilder knocks out Anthony Joshua and let me counterpunch. First of all, uh, shout out to uh, Beyond the Gloves, um, <clears throat> Michelle Joy Phelps uh, for the interview, and let me begin. Look, that breeds... Resentment, it breeds confidence, and it breeds anger. And let me explain. <clears throat> Tyson Fury rooting for Deontay Wilder is retribution, hoping, wanting Deontay Wilder to knock out Anthony Joshua. That's retribution for his feelings towards the negotiation or the negotiations, right? Which, by the way, I don't think that it's AJ's fault. Um, I do think <clears throat> it was a hand in hand type of deal. I think those type of deals were, you know, um, I think Tyson's to blame for a lot of that. But nonetheless, I think he would love nothing more than a guy that he knocked out last year. October 9th, 2021, to knock out the guy that he never got in the ring with. Because I think at this point, Tyson Fury knows that he's lost a lot of money on a potential fight with AJ because he took another L. And maybe, just maybe, something that he will probably never admit, but maybe he should have took that Anthony Joshua fight over the Wilder fight because he could have easily fought Wilder this year, you know, and then just push that along, right, Versus what he did just by beating a guy that he already beat the year before. <clears throat> so I think, in all actuality, I think Tyson Fury bet betting that much money on that. That means he really wants nothing else more than Anthony Joshua to get knocked the fuck out by a guy that knocked he's already knocked out. So if I can't get that opportunity, maybe I'll give it or hope and wish it on the guy that I knocked out. See, the burning brush, the burning bush of brush or bush of uh, Tyson Fury is his win over uh, Deontay Wilder. Um, Dillian White added a little bit to that, but only a small amount because Dillian White's been beaten before and he's been the only one that beat Deontay Wilder. So... You know, it's a double-edged sword. It's one way. Look, I hate AJ because I wanted to offer AJ and then to find out it's too difficult because he has too much going on versus me. Second, I don't want Wilder to get beat by AJ because then that'll take away my grand possession of doing it. Sure, I did it first, just like I did it with, with Vlad. But this guy come along and did the same thing I did then what do I have only for me? Now I got to fight the fucking bodybuilder. You see where I'm going with this? But anyway, I find it confidence. I find it uh, resentment. I find anger. You guys tell me what you think of Tyson the Gypsy King Fury betting that Deontay Wilder knocks out Anthony Joshua for a million quid. Of course, please subscribe. And you guys been counterpunch. Peace.